Hey, what's up with a happy Roblox family? So happy, so, so, so happy. With mom, dad, Daisy, Molly, and the baby. Cute baby. <laughs> la, 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 la. <laughs> Cute little baby. La, 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 la. <laughs> We're the Star Squad Smart. Don't forget to hit subscribe! Molly, open the door right now! <laughs> I locked you out! Molly, open the door! I don't have my house key! Well, I guess you're stuck outside for the rest of your life! <laughs> what are you doing home, Molly? It was early dismissal today, remember, Mom? Oh, man, I totally forgot about that! Why is Daisy still standing outside? Because she locked me out! She forgot her house key. It's not my fault. Molly, don't lock your sister out. Mo Molly, let her in. Mom, could you just let me in? She's so rude. Oh, boy, Molly. You're really being rude to your sister right now. Here you go, Daisy. Come on in. I can't believe it. Ow, I hit my head on the door. I'm having a bad afternoon. <laughs> Man, that was a real ignoramos move. Molly, qu uh, Mom, she's being such a brat right now. Molly, since you're home early, you never finished your chores last night. Why don't you start on um, vacuuming the house? Why don't you... Remind me in about an hour. I need to watch some TV. Molly, I do not like that attitude. Vacuum now. Why do I have to vacuum? Daisy's just playing on the computer. She's looking at puppies. That's not even fair. Because, Molly, she did her chores already, and you didn't. But it's early dismissal. That's supposed to mean no work for the rest of the day. Well, schoolwork. Oh, wow. There's a lot of crumbs on these chairs. Um, I'm thinking maybe you should vacuum those, too. Ah! Ah! Okay, I've got to go pick up baby Kira from preschool. Molly, I expect this vacuuming to be done by the time I get back. Uh-huh. Excuse me, Mom. You're where I need to vacuum. Bye, Molly. Try to turn that frown upside down. Daisy, you're in my way. Molly, you don't need to vacuum you. I'm sitting here. Fine. Well, I guess I can't do my work then because Daisy's in the way. Oh, well. I'll have to watch TV. Ah, <sighs> that's better. Ah, <sighs> that's more like it. You're going to get grounded for life, Molly. You're going to get grounded for life, Molly. <laughs> I'm just telling you, Molly. Quit nagging me. Quit being a brat. Oh, hi, girls. What is going on? The floors are a mess. Hi, baby Kira. Well, I tried to vacuum, but Daisy wouldn't get out of the way. I'm just sitting over here quietly. Molly, I cannot believe how big of a brat you're being today. Ugh. Get the vacuum out and finish vacuuming. And then, because you were so naughty, you can help me make dinner. I do not want to do all these chores. Ugh, being my age is so annoying. There's so many responsibilities. Baby Kira, I'm going to be more like you, okay? I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Uh-huh, exactly. <coughs> Baby Kira? Wait a minute, you're not Baby Kira. Molly, what are you doing crawling on the floor and whining like a baby? I want my dinner. I'm hungry. Wah. Molly, why are you acting that way? Stand up right now. I can't. Wah. I don't want to be this age anymore. You ask too much of me. I'm going back to being Baby Kira's age. Ugh. Molly, if you want to act like a baby, then I'll treat you like one. You'll see. Tomorrow, things are going to be a lot different around here. The next morning. Ah, ah, where's the coffee? I need to wake up my brain. What? No coffee for you, little girl. Huh? What? what are you talking about? I need the coffee. Give me the coffee. Uh, you can have a baby bottle for breakfast. What? What's this? It's a baby bottle, like I said. Why do I want a baby bottle? I don't want this. Mom, where's the coffee? You said you wanted to be a baby, and a baby is what you'll be. Wait, what? 
You didn't want to do your chores. You wanted to be a brat, just like a preschooler. So now you're going to be a preschooler again. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Mom totally called you out on your game, Molly. What? Mom? Oh, this is ridiculous. Okay, everybody, let's get in the car. Time for school. Mama, we're flipping to the wheels on the bus. Okay, baby Kira. Oh, no. Not this song again. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round. Oh, this is terrible. My ears, they feel like they're going to bleed. Oh, round and round, round and round. Have a great day, Daisy. Wait, I don't have to go to school? Oh, no, Molly. This is not where you're going to school today. La, 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 la. What are you talking about, Mom? Where would I be going to school? Oh, well, you're a preschooler now, aren't you? Wait, what? What are you talking about, Mom? <laughs> oh, honey, I want you to have the best day at your new school. My new school? What are you talking about? Well, you're going back to preschool, of course. Mom, are you being serious right now? Mom, what are you talking about? I already called the teacher. Now get out of the car, Molly. Come on, baby Kira. Come on, Molly. I am not going back to preschool, Mom. You are, my dear. Now get out of the van. But, Mom. Well, you were such a baby last night. You should be used to going to preschool. Mom, you cannot be serious. I totally am, Molly. Have a great day. Now go inside and meet your new teacher. Oh, um, gee. No, no, no. Good morning, baby Kira. And good morning, new student. There's been a mistake. I I'm not a baby. Oh, your mom said you've been acting like a baby, so... You belong here. I'm Miss Sarah, and I'm going to be your teacher today. No, I don't want you to be my teacher. I, I don't like this. Not at all. Oh, I can see you are very talkative. But it's not talk time. It's quiet time. Here, let's put a passy in your mouth so you're quiet. I don't want a passy. See, now isn't that better? Now, why don't you go sit on the carpet like a good little girl? I, I don't want to eat a passy. You can get time out. Sit on the carpet or you're going to have a time out. Give me a time out then. I don't care. Oh, you asked for it. Oh my gosh. I'm in a crib in a time out. This is ridiculous. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round. Come on, class. Sing it with me. No, this is my worst nightmare. Oh my gosh, I never want to be a baby. Not ever again. Oh, someone's cranky. Why don't you lay down and take a nap, baby? Does somebody need a diaper change? Do you have a booby diaper? No, crazy lady. Oh my gosh. I'm stuck in this crib laying down with a passy in my mouth. All because I acted like a brat. And my mom sent me back to preschool. Oh. oh, it seems that your baby sister is more better behaved than you are, dear. Now, here's your bottle. Drink your bottle like a good little baby. Oh, I promise I'll be good, Mom. Please, please. I want to call my mommy. Um, okay. I guess since you're upset, you can call your mom. Mom? Mom, are you there? Molly, what's going on? How's preschool going? I have a pacifier in my mouth. The teacher just gave me a timeout in a crib and, and wants me to take a nap with a bottle of milk. Please come get me, Mom, please. I promise I'll behave. I think you can finish the rest of the day there. Maybe tomorrow we'll talk about you being, well, your normal age again. Have a great day. Mom! Did she just hang up on me? Mom? Mom! Hi, this is Laura. Please leave a message after the beep. Beep. Oh, she sent me to voicemail. Oh, this is so annoying. Would you like to join the rest of the class now? Fine. Okay, everybody, let's sing it together. The wheels on the bus go round and round. Oh, round and round. I love this song. I get to get up with you. I know you do, baby Kira. I know. <laughs> somebody what the, we were trying to do the intro put me down right now 
You need to have a bottle and a night night. No, I need to do the intro to this YouTube video. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> this is okay, Daisy. I'll do the intro by myself. Guys, today we're in Twilight Daycare and, oh wait, Daisy's back. We are going to be playing the wow. new mermaid story. OMG. I can't wait to be a baby mermaid. Me evil. Why is this person standing in front? Oh my gosh. I can't even with this intro right now. <laughs> Oh, very funny, Molly. Oh, now your back is to every fan in the entire world. Sorry, I'm doing my best. You, I really do need a nap. <laughs> okay, this this girl with the bunny ears wants to be in our video, so we're gonna let her. Hey, what's up? Wait, what's your name? I can't see your name. Um. Oh my God! She just turned into a me clone. Weird. <laughs> Molly, she might be a super fan. Yeah, she wants to be my twinsy. The first thing I need is a mermaid outfit. Oh, purple mermaid, yellow mermaid, security dolphin, Mr. Fish, brown pirate, pink pirate, fairy tale princess. Oh my gosh, they have a lot of new stuff in here. But I'm gonna definitely be um the purple mermaid. And I'm gonna be the yellow mermaid. Holy cow, 249 Robux. Okay, so worth it though, so worth it so that I can... Be the purple mermaid. You've earned a new sticker. Oh, I got a vending machine sticker. Oh my gosh. Buy the mermaid den house and then you get the mermaid den house. Oh, I'm the cutest little purple mermaid ever. Oh, wow, Molly. Um, you are pretty adorable. Thank you. I know I am. <laughs> and I've earned another sticker. Oh, that sticker is so beautiful. I love it. Daisy, oh my God, you're adorable as a baby mermaid. I know, right? Like, look at my pigtails. They turned green. <laughs> I think you look adorable. Thanks, Molly. Now, come on. We better get to the water before our tails dry out. Good point. Let's go. I'm not going to make it back to the ocean. I'm not going to make it. Don't say that, Molly. We have to make it back to the ocean. I'm so thirsty. And my tail is so dry. Uh, look, Molly, we made it. Hooray, let's get out of here. Oh, home sweet home. Ah, now that's much better. I love this under the sea place. It's my favorite place to be. Daisy, I'm starving. I know, being in the human world is, well, exhausting, and I'm so hungry. Well, I have a little leftover chocolate. Uh, no, Molly, we need to get in our high chairs and eat real food. Okay. I'm not sure I'm good at feeding myself yet. Ah, I spilled some on my face. It's okay, Molly, just try, because you're super hungry and you're getting grumpy. Mmm, that was good. Mmm. Ah, I feel all better. Ah, <sighs> except for the fact that... I'm kind of tired. And also, I need to have my teeth brushed. Oh, my mommy. Well, Molly, I don't know where our mommy is right now. She she might be, um well, up in the human world. But I want my mommy. Oh, that's just great, Molly. You earned a you cried stickle. <laughs> oh, seriously. Oh, my gosh. I keep earning so many stickers. Oh, I don't want any more stickers right now. Molly, let's read a story and maybe take a night-night. Good idea. I always like to read a story before I go take a nap. Time to start exploring Atlantis. Pearl, I don't think we should go that way. Why? What's wrong? Only that creepy dolphin who doesn't stop looking at us. Hey, I have a name and it's Jeff. You can't enter this area unless you have a ticket. How can we even get one? You can't. They're sold out. Ugh, fine. Think you can at least help us find any treasure around here? Sure. There's some right over there. Oh, that was quick. Thanks, Jeff. And so the mermaid friends went to explore the treasure. This has some really nice jewelry we can take home. That's true. But it stinks we can't visit Atlantis. I may be able to help with that. Jeez, don't sneak in on us like that. You scared me. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Anyway, if you let me keep this jewelry, I will give you two tickets to visit Atlantis. You've got a deal, but couldn't you just take it yourself? It is free to take. I could, but if Jeff sees me taking one more necklace, he's gonna freak out. And I want something nice for my wife's birthday. Oh, I see. Well, here you go. Happy birthday to your wife. And here are your tickets. Have fun. Yay! 
Great, we can finally visit Atlantis. We're going to have such a fun time there. <laughs> Molly, why are you still crying? We read a story. Do you want a night night now? No, I want my mommy. We got to go find her. I think she's still in the human world. You want to go back to the human world? If it means finding our mommy, then yes. She must be lost and, and we've got to find her. I want my mommy. Well, I want to take a nap. I want sleep. Not until we find our mommy. Hey, you're not my mommy. Put me down. <laughs> I'll make it so you never see your mommy again. You'll be stuck at this daycare forever. <laughs> and once you turn into a human, you can never go back to mermaid land. <laughs> you're evil. Get away from me, crazy. Oh, um, gee, he was literally trying to turn me into a human forever. Hey, stop it! I need to find my mom! Oh, wow. Okay, um, obviously, yeah, he is evil and wants to turn me into a human, even though I'm a baby mermaid. Oh, my gosh. And now I'm separated from Daisy and my mom, and I don't know what to do. I need my mom! Oh, wow. look, it's the ice cream truck! No, I have to stay focused. I have to stay focused. Wait, what was I doing? I really want a chocolate ice cream. Oh, well, who cares what I was doing? Just need a chocolate ice cream. La 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 la. Ooh, what you got? Popsicles? Chocolate ice cream. Strawberry ice cream, a red popsicle. Ice cream with a cherry, chocolate, and vanilla with strawberry on top. Yes, please. Oh, do I not have any money? What? But I wanted ice cream. Ah oh, wait, there it is. I got it. Okay, cool. Mm. Mm, that's good. Oopsie, I spilled a little bit. <laughs> what was I doing again? Oh, yeah. Look at for my mom. Molly? Is, is that you? Mom! Mommy! Oh my gosh, there you are! I was so afraid I'd never see you again! Molly, what are you doing in the human world? You're supposed to be staying in mermaid land. I only came here so I could get a job working at the daycare and to learn more about humans. Their babies are so cute, aren't they? Why did you follow me here? Because I was curious about the human world too, Mom! Oh, honey. Mom, where's your where's your mermaid tail? Are you a human forever? No, honey. As soon as I get back in the water, my mermaid tail, tail will reappear. That's because I'm a grown-up. Mama! Mom! You both followed me to human land? Oh, my gosh. You're both going to get timeouts. Yeah, and I don't feel very good. I eat ice cream and made my tummy hurt. Oh, honey. Oh, okay, well, come on. Let's get you both to mermaid land so you can get feeling all better. Seems like you both need a nap. Can you carry me back to mermaid land? Oh, I don't feel so good. Of course I can, sweetie. Ooh, you are feeling sick. We need to get you girls back before you lose your tails forever. I don't want to lose my tail forever. Come on, Molly. We gotta get back to mermaid land. And maybe next time you girls will listen to me and stay in mermaid land where you belong. <laughs>
Okay, wee! <laughs> That's all I can say right now is wee! Daisy, are you gonna wait for me or what? Rude! Well, you weren't waiting for me. I thought I'd just return the favor. Wait, did we just escape already? We're like in the backyard. No, there's Granny chasing Daisy. Baby Granny, baby Granny, baby Granny, yeah! Oh, what? What just happened? Oh my gosh. Granny's been eating too many cupcakes. Uh oh, baby granny needs a nap. She is miserable. All right, guys. Uh oh. What's this all about? We went down this hole in the, like a well or whatever, and this is what happened. Um, okay. Maybe if we go this way. Yeah, I think we're supposed to go this way. Is this supposed to be like down in it, like a water well or something? I don't know. It's the sewer or something like that. I'm like guacamole. This is crazy town. I don't know if that save worked, but I hope it did. Sometimes they don't light up and then I get nervous. I'm like, did it save? Did it save? Did it save? Well, let's try not to die until we get to the next save. Ooh. Okay, well, I died. <laughs> no, it didn't save. Yes, it did, Miley. You didn't make it to the next save, so that's where you have to restart. Uh, ah, I died again. What's wrong with me right now? Okay, I can do it this time. I know it. Ugh. Okay, I think I'm just getting nervous because you have to make it past that thing before it kills you. Okay, I pushed the jump button! One eternity later. Okay, see, there's definitely some ledge there. Finally! Yes, finally, Molly. I feel like half of my life has gone by waiting for you. Yeah, but now who's ahead, huh? 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 Okay, yeah, Molly, but you just died, so you're not ahead again. I just want to make it, please. Let me make it. You made it, Molly! Congratulations! You're only a little bit of a noob. Are we supposed to jump? This looks kind of scary. Jump in the pool of water! Okay, the pool of water is um deeper than I thought, so that's a good thing. Boink! I hit save! Daisy, you're gonna make the giant jump? Ooh! I'm right here! I keep getting hit by that giant fan! Oh, poor Daisy. I'll wait for you, Daisy. Yes! She made it that time! Good job, Daisy. Thank you. I tried very hard not to be a noob, and I failed. Guys, it is almost time for summer vacation. Are you guys as excited as I am? Seriously, I cannot... Ah! I cannot wait to go to the water park. Hang out, not have school, you know. What are you going to do this summer, Daisy? Read lots of books and get smarter. Of course you are. Don't you just want to, like, chill? I'm going to chill some, too. I'm going to go to the water park. Maybe to Disney and stuff. Whoa, Disney. Wow, you better ask mom and dad about that. I've been saving my money. I'm good. Oh my gosh, it's a speed run. Woohoo! Okay, this is fun. I like speed runs. Me too, Molly, but they always try to trick you. Whoa, I almost died, but I didn't. That was a miracle. Yeah, with you playing, it really is. Oh, funny! <laughs> I'm so funny today. All right, we've got to climb up all these ladders. I haven't seen baby granny in a while, but I'm thinking I'm going to end up back in her house right about. Well, nope, I didn't. I thought maybe we'd go back in her house, but we didn't. No, we got to jump on more pipes and then go through this cave or whatever. What? Why are we going through a cave and escape baby granny? I don't understand. She set up this Ooh. obstacle course so we could never leave. Ooh. Ah, well, it's working. We both died one right after another. Totally a noob move, Molly. Hey, you died too. I know. I was sick. I was a noob. Well, we both were there, Daisy. We both were. More ladders? Seriously? Well, we came out of the well. We're back at Granny's house. There she is. Baby Granny looks sort of evil. Sort of evil? Baby Granny looks really evil. Oh, now we're going down into the cellar. Hmm. Oh, more pipes? Are you kidding me? How many more pipes do we need to escape, huh? Huh? What a lot if you're you because you keep dying. <laughs> O-M-G. So do you guys have any cool plans for this summer? What are you, what are you gonna do? You're gonna read a lot? I actually do like reading over the summer. It's kind of like a challenge. I try to read like one book a week. But I also try to play Roblox every day. I also love to go biking. I love to swim. I like to listen to music. Maybe we could go to a concert. I love that. Ooh, that would be fun. What concert are we going to? I don't know. I'm just saying. We could go to a Taylor Swift concert. That would be amazing. Yeah, if you could get tickets. The Airways Tour is like, got 75,000 people going to it. Every single ticket is sold out. Oh, man. I'd love to go to that show. 
You're gonna send me a ticket? <laughs> what is this? I'm giant meatballs. All right, this is the thing, Daisy. Hide behind these and you should be okay. Giant meatballs trying to kill me. Really, I don't think they're always meatballs. They feel like they're always meatballs. Whoa, no! Oh, it was so close. That's annoying. All right, let's try this again, people. This makes me want to eat spaghetti. <laughs> or maybe a meatball sub. If you guys could eat anything, what would you eat? I'm following Daisy's footsteps because she, she did really good. Oh my gosh, don't let me die. Please, 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 please. Yes, I made it! Hooray! Yeah, because you copied what I did. Copycat. Whatever. Whatever. I, 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 I won. That's all that matters. You should have copy, Molly. It's rude. But it was the right way to go, and you knew it. So you should be flattered that I, I copied you, and you were so smart that you figured it out. Well, you have a point there, Molly. Oh, my gosh. My car is so slow. Wait a minute. Did we just finish? I think we did, Molly. We escaped baby granny. We didn't even have to fight her at the end. Are you serious? Nope. No epic boss battle on this one. Hooray! That's awesome! Get in! Oh my gosh, you can actually play these other games we haven't played before. Yes, but right now, I'm gonna go get a snack. <laughs> Ooh, gravity! Ooh, this is gonna be fun. It didn't work. How about the jump one? The jump one works, Molly! Whoa! Um, so did somebody put baby granny down for a nap? Is that why we didn't have to fight the epic boss at the end? Probably, Molly. That's probably true. What happens if you jump over the edge? Don't do that, Molly. You're gonna die. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Daisy's like freaking out. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching today. Um, Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to play Baby Granny, you totally should. Yeah, it was really fun. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, guys. Whoa. Well, if you're the last one in the house, you are. <laughs> hey, Mom. Oh, hey, Molly. Hey, Daisy. How was school today? It was great. I got an A on my science exam. Good job, Daisy. How'd you do, Molly? I got a B plus. What? I'm so happy. That's amazing. Wait, Mom, why do you have a suitcase? What's going on? Um, well, your father and I decided we needed a little vacation. Whoa! A vacation? Where are we going? I'm so excited. Are we going to Disney? That would be amazing. <gasps> oh, could we go to Paris? I've never been to Paris. Uh, Molly, uh, duh. We are gonna go and, um, see London for the first time. I just know it because remember I did my school project about that? Molly, what are you doing? Do you have to go potty? No, I'm just so excited. I can't even stand still. I'm sorry, girls, but this is a trip for your dad and I, a couple's trip, for us to reconnect and spend a couple days together. You guys are staying with your grandma and going to school. So let me get this straight. You get to go on a vacation somewhere amazing, and Daisy and I still have to go to school? How is that fair? Well, your father and I work very hard to pay the bills around here. Don't you think we need a break every now and again? She does, does have a point, Miley. But, but we work really hard, too. Why can't we have a break? Molly, you're going to go to your grandma's. You're going to have so much fun. I get that, Molly. I love grandma's. Mom, where are you going? Where are you going? We're going to go to the beach for a couple of days. The beach? Oh, I want to go to the beach. Girls, go pack your bags. I'll drop you off at grandma's before dad and I go to the airport. Mom, did you forget something? No, baby Kira just got in the car. Don't worry, I'm not going to leave one of my kids home alone. That would just be crazy. I know you grandma's house. Wah, 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 wah. Grandma house, grandma house. Ma, you and Gwen go grandma house? No, I don't. I want to go to the beach. I don't want to go to school. Molly, it's not going to be that bad. Yes, it is, Daisy. Yes, it is. I had a boy, yeah, I had a boy. I go in grandma's house. It's gonna be fun. Yeah, Molly, listen to baby Kira. Your little sister's right. It is gonna be so fun. You love grandma. We're here. Ugh, grandma's house is so nice. Why are you saying it like that, Molly, if you think it's so nice? Because it's not as nice as the beach. We're not having to go to school. I did a cute place. I love it, it's a boy, it's a giant, your papa. I love it too, baby Kira. Don't listen to Molly. She's just being a grump monster. Oh, 
Oh, girls, I'm so glad to see you. Hi, Daisy. Hi, Grandma. Hi, Baby Kira. I love you too, dear. Oh, my. Who's this grumpy girl on my doorstep? Surely this cannot be my granddaughter, Molly. Don't worry, it's her. But she's so miserable because mom and dad are going to the beach and she can't. She has to stay here and go to school. But you get to spend the night with me, Molly, and I'm so much fun. Now I'm going to cook some burgers in the backyard. Who wants to come with me? Molly, I made your favorite dessert. Molly, how can you be grumpy when Grandma made your favorite dessert? Well, yeah, you've kind of got a point. I'm not saying I'm happy about being home, left home without going on vacation, but Grandma, you are pretty awesome. Oh, thank you, dear. I love you all. And the apple pie is cooling in the kitchen window. We'll have it after we have some delicious cheeseburgers. Sounds good. I got to buy it. I did your papa. Whoa, your pie got huge. I'm jumping in it. Molly, it's too cold to swim. I'm still swimming in it. Whoa, this is so cool. Grandma, um, are you going to get some koi fish? I may eventually, dear. Or maybe some piranhas. Whoa, we couldn't swim in it then. Holy guacamole, they'd be chomp chomping us. <laughs> it would keep the burglars out, that's for sure. Yeah, it'd be like you lived in a castle. <laughs> you have like a moat around your house, Grandma. I'll be right back, Grandma. I want to see if there's any fun things on TV right now. Oh, dear. There's nothing on TV. The door's locked, Grandma. That's because you're not allowed to watch TV all day when you're... Oh, no! I'm burning the burgers! Oh, jeepers, gee willikers. Don't worry, Grandma. I'll help you with that. Thank you, dear. What I was trying to say is you don't need to watch TV here. Tons of fun things to do. Now, come on. Let's eat. I need to watch it. I need to Bring a good cheeseburger, Grandma. I need to watch Oh, dear. You have ketchup all over your face. Yeah. Mm. She usually is like that when she's eating. She's kind of messy. So what, uh, you, Molly? You have ketchup on your nose. What? I do? <laughs> yeah, you look ridiculous. Grandma, what are you doing? Oh, I just have to take my pills before I can eat. Pills for what? Oh, just about everything, Molly. Once you get old, well, your body just decides it's going to, I don't know, not work right, I guess. Whoa, I hope I never get old. Me too. Now, what time are your girls' bedtime? Uh, Baby Kira's bedtime is at 8. Ours is at midnight. Molly, that's a lie. Wow, your mom lets you stay up really late these days. Yeah, it's because we got good grades at school, right, Daisy? Molly... Daisy doesn't want to stay up to midnight because she gets really grumpy in the morning, which is totally fine, but I'm gonna. I mean, since I have to go to school and I'm not on vacation. All right, well, whatever you say, dear. But you do have to get out of bed in the morning for school, so don't forget. I won't, Grandma. I won't. Hey, where's my pajamas? Oh, my God, I forgot to pack them. Grandma! Grandma! Okay, where's Grandma? Are they still outside? Though we were coming in to brush our teeth. Baby Kira, what are you doing out here? I got a side put on my pajamas. Good night, night. Okay, where's Grandma? Because I have to tell her I forgot my pajamas. She out there, I think I'm cleaning up the mess from dinner. Oh, no, dear. I'm up here just setting up the beds for you guys. Grandma, I forgot my pajamas. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Don't worry, dear. I have a pair of pajamas you can borrow. Go ahead and get in the dresser and get a pair out. Okay. Grandma, these are old lady pajamas. Well, duh, I am an old lady. But look at that adorable cat. Grumpy cat. Oh, boy. I'm so embarrassed right now. Good thing no one else see you in your sleep. Now, off to bed. No, Grandma, I get to stay up to midnight, remember? Are you sure that's what your mother said? Yeah, absolutely. She also said that I can eat three pieces of apple pie. Three? Oh my, you'll get a stomach ache. Yeah, and then you'll be puking all night long, Molly. Nope, that's what she said. I'm totally fine with eating three pieces of pie. I'll be fine. 
Okay, dear, I just don't want you to get the diarrheas. <laughs> That's such a funny word. Well, I'm just saying that would be awful. Good night, dear. Now don't stay up too late. I won't, Grandma. Ugh, finally, everyone else is asleep. And I can go watch some TV and just chill. While eating apple pie and other desserts, by the way. <laughs> Look at that little chipmunk. That's just like me when I eat apple pie. Ugh, I've got to stuff it all in my mouth. Yes, yes I do. Well, I'm all full of apple pie, but I found this birthday cake in Grandma's refrigerator. I'm sure she won't mind if I eat it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was good. Ugh. I don't feel so good. My stomach hurts so bad. Oh, my stomach is gonna explode. Gotta get to the bathroom. Gotta get to the bathroom. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. There. That wasn't so bad. Ugh. Ugh. I don't think I need to eat any more cake, though. But I feel a lot better now. Oh, uh, uh. no, no, I don't. Oh my gosh, gotta get to the bathroom. The next, <laughs> the next morning. Oh, I had a lovely night's sleep, and now I think I'll make the girls waffles for breakfast. Mm -hmm, I sure will. Good morning, Grandma. Oh my, you scared me. I'm not used to having company. <laughs> oh, sorry, Grandma. Hey, have you seen Molly? What? N no, is she not up in bed? I uh, no, she never came to bed. And I thought maybe she fell asleep on the couch, but she's not there evil. Oh dear, I wonder what could have happened to her. Let's look around the cottage and see if we can find her. <laughs> Hi, Molly, why are you sleeping next to the toilet? Oh, poor thing. I was so sick last night. Oh dear, you should have woken me up. What happened? I ate all the apple pie and then some of that birthday cake. What? That was for my friend's hundredth birthday. I'll help you bake another one, Grandma. Uh, but uh, it made me go and also and a little bit of and a lot of and my stomach hurt really bad. Well, dear, serves you right. I hope you learned your lesson eating my friend's birthday cake. And you stayed up all night on the toilet, didn't you? Um, yeah. <sighs> well, let's get you cleaned up for school. I can't go to school. I hardly slept. Oh, dear. Well, here. You can take one of these Pepto-Bismols and you'll be right as rain. Oh, those Pepto-Bismols taste terrible. Well, dear, I think you should think about that before you eat so many treats and stay up so late. You know, Grandma, I used to think you're just old, but turns out you're pretty smart, too. It comes with being on this planet for so many years. You learn a lot, like don't eat too much pie and cake or you'll poo poop all night long. <laughs> yeah. Ugh, that was the worst. Grandma, I made some waffles. Hey, Molly, you want a waffle? Huh, waffle? Oh, that sounds gross. Ugh. Something tells me Molly's going to be skipping breakfast today. Yeah, <laughs> she probably is. <laughs> Did you have a good day? I don't want to go home. I had to get you my fun. You don't want to go home because you had so much fun? Oh, sweet girl. I'm so glad you like your new preschool. Well, like, I can't come in today. Uh, no, it's, uh, I, I, I can't work tonight. Because I have my twins. That's why I'm here picking them up from preschool. Uh, no, I don't want to lose my job. Okay, all right, I'll come in. If I can find a babysitter. Oh, hi. You must be a new mom, too. Yeah, I'm Lorelai. Oh, well, I'm Laura. Our names are almost the same. <laughs> yeah, I'm having a really bad day because my boss wants me to work a shift because one of the other employees got sick and I don't have anyone to watch my twins. 
Well, I'm sure we could have a play date with my daughter. And you could come pick him up at my house later. Does that work? Oh my gosh, you do that for me? Yeah, that would work great. I don't think so, Mom. Yup, yup, yup. What do you mean, baby Kira? You love play dates. No, 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 no. I think a bad idea. No. No, I want you. Baby Kira, what's got into you? I'm sorry, Lorelai. She probably just needs a diaper change or maybe a bottle. Yeah, I don't need anything. I, I don't want to have a play date with the twins. Baby Kira, don't be rude. Besides, I already told Lorelai, so just try to have fun, okay? All right, Lorelai, I'll text you my address and you can pick up the twins after you're done with your work shift. Thanks again so much, Laura. You really saved my life on this one. Or at least my job. No problem. I don't know why I did that, Mom. Those twins, they're evil. What? They're evil? <laughs> they're just babies like you. Don't be ridiculous. Here, baby Kira, take your passy and try to be very sweet to the twins. See? Isn't everything all better now? I don't think so. Okay, Megan and Tegan, you guys can sit in the third row. Don't forget to buckle your seatbelts. I want to sit next to her because she smells bad. I don't smell bad. I smell like, um, uh, like my bath bubbles. Oh, yeah, she does smell really bad. Baby Kira smells like a piggy. <laughs> They're not funny. Quit teasing me, Megan and Tegan. Mommy! What, baby Kira? What's going on back there? They're being made to be all ready! Oh, my goodness. You little kids are something else. Just try to get along, okay, everyone? We're gonna go to a super fun diner for dinner. Then we'll go to the park. Oh, boy! We'll go and book it in diner. Mega and Tika, you're gonna love it. I'm so glad I got this mom bus. Turns out I really need it. <laughs> La 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 Ew, her singing's bad. I know, Tegan, her singing is really bad. Hey, don't talk about my mommy that way. Okay, girls, each of you can get something from the menu for dinner, and then you can each have a dessert. Oh, boy, I love dessert, mommy. Thank you. You're welcome, baby Kira. Megan, Tegan, what would you like from the menu? Mama, mama, mama! Wait a minute, baby Kira. I just asked Megan and Tegan what they're having. Okay, I'll wait then. I'm gonna have an ice cream. And I'm gonna have some pie. No, girls, you have to eat something for dinner first. Baby Kira, what are you gonna have for dinner? Maybe the girls will have the same thing. I'm gonna have uh, a cheap burger and... Um, and how about a vegetable? You wanna pick a vegetable? A fruit salad? Yeah, you can have a cheeseburger and a fruit salad. Those are great choices. Okay, Megan and Tegan, what are you going to have? I'm gonna have, like I said, an ice cream. I, I can have pie. I told you they were evil. You did this to me though, Mom. Baby Kira, go sit in your chair, please. They aren't evil, they're just being a little naughty. Whoa, that's the biggest cheeseburger we ever saw in my whole life. Oh, wow. And the fruit salad looks good, too. I don't know why I had your robot. She's so annoying. She still talks like a baby, Megan. I know, Tegan, she does. Yeah, what's this? I'm not eating this. Well, I ordered it for you since all you wanted to order was dessert. I got you some tacos and I got you some chicken and salad. Doesn't that look really good? No, I don't want to eat that. It looks gross. You're a bad babysitter. I told you they were evil, Mom. I told you. Baby Kara, sit down and eat your dinner. It's not nice to call Megan and Tegan evil. I think they are, though, Mom. I think they are. I'm not eating anything unless I have my apple pie. Um, okay, well, um, I guess you aren't eating anything then because... You can't eat apple pie for dinner, and you're gonna get very hungry. Oh, thank you! You're rude! You're rude, lady! I wanna go home! Whoa! Now my mom can see how evil they really are. One hour later. 
Okay, girls, you only have about 30 minutes. It's starting to get dark, and then we're gonna go back so your mom can pick you up. I'll get a swing on that swing. Oh, there's one for all of us. Whee! No, I want to swing on that swing. Get off of there. Don't push me. Ah, oh, Megan! Ah, oh, Megan, you pushed me. I could you. Ah. Well, you should have gotten off the swing. Oh my god, baby Kira, are you okay? Are you okay? I, I can't move my foot. I think I broke it. I need to move my foot. Oh my gosh. Megan and Tegan, you guys are being extremely naughty. And now you pushed her up the swing and, and, and she's probably really hurt. Oh my gosh. You guys really are evil. <laughs> We're wondering if you are ever going to figure it out, lady. Okay, I need to call your mom. And then I need to take baby Kira to the hospital. Mom, it really hurts. I need to leave you out of you. Well, scratch that. I think I'll have to take these girls to the hospital and call their mom from there. She's not picking up. Megan, Tegan, don't let me see you doing anything else naughty today. For reals. You girls are going to make me crazy. Now, come on, baby Kira. Let's get you to the hospital and get that leg looked at. Megan, Tegan, keep up, please. We're coming. Jeepers. You're so bossy. <laughs> My leg really hurts. <laughs> oh, baby Kira, I'm so, so sorry, honey. I love you. Um, uh, Megan, why don't you go and get baby Kira some water? Here, here's some money. You can get it out of the vending machine. It's just around the corner. Do you think you can do that? Yeah, sure. I do it. <laughs> Tegan, I dare you to get in that x-ray machine. No, Megan, I dare you to get in it. <laughs> I can't wait to see what all your bones look like. I bet you won't even have a brain. Oh, uh, whatever, Megan. I will have a brain. <laughs> Look at you. You would say I dream machine and I'm a big doctor that says, um, hmm, nope, you have no brain. What? Yes, I do have a brain. Nope, see, you don't. I don't see a brain in there. Whatever. I definitely have one. Look at all these adorable little babies being so quiet, Megan. I know what you mean, Tegan. <laughs> Let's go some trouble. Let's have a rock concert. La 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 la. What are you girls doing? I sent you for a bottle of water, and you're wrecking the entire hospital. Ah! Go get the bottle of water right now. We got your water, and maybe now you can grow a new leg. Oh my gosh. You two really are the most evil identical twins ever. I need to call your mom and have her come pick you up right away. It just keeps ringing. Oh, wait, I think it's going to voicemail. Hi, you've reached Lorelei. I'm currently in Cancun and I'll be back next week. Can't believe I found someone to watch the kids. I needed this break so bad. Leave a message after the beep, but I probably won't check it till next week. Lorelei, you come get these evil twins right now! <laughs> Why are you crying right now? Because that was the best Netflix series ever! <laughs> uh, okay, but why are you crying if it was the best series ever? Because now it's over! And I don't want it to be over! I want more episodes! And, 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 uh, how will I know if Wednesday is okay? Well, we have to wait till next season. But don't worry, Molly, there's this amazing new episode of Brook High. Who cares about Brook High? I want to watch Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. Well, maybe we could talk about the series, and that will make it so you don't miss it so much. Yeah. Okay. 
I loved Enid. I think her and Wednesday are more alike than anyone realizes. What? What are you talking about? They're like total opposites. Molly, they remind me of me and you a lot, actually. Well, we're nothing alike. Well, we're sort of alike in some ways. No, we're not. We're nothing alike. Um, but I am kind of like a Wednesday. Well, I feel like I'm like Enid. Well, I'm just saying that we're nothing alike. I think we're a lot more alike than you think we are. And I dare you to do a morning routine tomorrow with me where I'm Enid and you're Wednesday. And I'll show you how much alike we are. And I'll show you how much we're not alike. Well, Molly, are you going to take the deal? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> it's morning. Wednesday, wake up. No, what? Who is she calling Wednesday? Is she going crazy? Huh, what? Wednesday, it's me, Enid. Molly, wake up. You're supposed to be Wednesday this morning, remember? Oh, what? I thought you were just kidding about that. <sighs> Molly, come on! You took the deal! Do you want to lose? Huh? What? No? Huh? Just give me five minutes, okay? You won't be Wednesday in five minutes. You could never. Oh, yeah? Watch me. Well, oh, I have five minutes to be Wednesday, so that means four of those I can go back to sleep. Okay, I've got to be Wednesday. Got to wake up. Got to be Wednesday. Ha ha ha! Look at me. I am so ready for this Wednesday morning routine. Oh, Wednesday! It's time to get ready for school. Enid, where are you? Your chipper self is annoying me right now. You're too happy in the morning. I'm just down making a delicious breakfast with rainbow sprinkles. Rainbow sprinkles? Seriously? Ugh, her cheer is starting to get on my nerves. I may have to kill you today. Whoa, why are you so short? Why are you so tall? Whoa, what's the thing on your head? Uh, duh, this is my little friend named Thing. He's a severed hand. Be careful, let her drip blood on you. Um, O, M, Gee, that's disgusting! I can't believe you're my actual roommate. I just drank a ton of coffee, so I hope my werewolf doesn't come out. What do you have for breakfast? The souls of my enemies! <laughs> you're being serious right now? Yeah, totally. And right now, you're my enemy. Okay, well, let's get going to school. Um, whatever you have for breakfast, I hope it's a good one. <laughs> I'm just going to go in and collect my books and stuff. I don't need books. I remember everything. I have, like, a photographic memory of everything that's ever happened to me in my entire life. I've got to brush my teeth because, you know, I like to have the most shiniest and sharpest teeth. Sharp teeth? What, what are you talking about, Wednesday? Oh, uh, I just I just sharpen my teeth up with some uh, with some rock toothpaste in the morning. What? What are you talking about? No, seriously, I do. Because if I ever have to bite somebody in a fight, I want to make sure that my teeth are like a vampires. You know, vampires go to a school, right? Uh huh. Pwick, pwick. Molly, are you still pretending you're Wednesday? Who's Molly? What do you think I have split personalities or something? <laughs> la 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 la. Wednesday? In case we run into that monster in the woods on the way to school. I plan on taking the school bus. The school bus? Are you serious? I would rather die! Oh, okay. Well, we don't have to take the school bus if you don't want to, but everybody's so friendly. You'd really like the other werewolves. I barely like the one in front of me. Wow. My roommate is kind of rude. Yeah, don't you think she's nothing like you at all? No, I'm sure we have some similarities, and I'm going to find them. I'll be down in a few minutes. I have to do my month, my morning journal. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Oh, I definitely need a latte. Today, I found out I have the most annoying roommate ever. Her name is Eden. Enid. Enith? Edith? I don't know. I think it's Enid. But she is definitely a demon. She's so friendly and nice, and oh, I swear she poops rainbows. 
Now I have to go to school, so I'll talk to you later, Journal. I know, Thing. I don't like going to public education either. It's just a prison for our brains. A prison! Uh, Molly, why do you have a giant umbrella? It's not even raining. Because I don't want the evil sun to touch my skin. It might burn me! Molly, getting some sunshine every day is good for you. Look how cheery it makes me! Yep, definitely need the umbrella then. Wednesday, this is not the way to school! I told you, I have to hunt down that monster. I don't recall you saying that. Well, I have to, Enid. The safety of Nevermore and all of our town is, is, is at risk. This is not our responsibility. We should tell the teachers at Nevermore. Blah, 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 blah. What are you, chicken? Absolutely. I haven't even turned into my werewolf form yet. Well, no time like the present. Come on, I think I found its cave. I'm not a very good swimmer. You'll be fine. Come on. What's that? <laughs> um, uh, Wednesday, I, I agree with you, Molly. You win. They're nothing alike. I'm going to school. Enid, don't you dare run away. I'm, I'm going to need you. Enid! What a chicken. Okay, Hyde. It's you and me. Take that, Hyde. And that. And that. Oh. I actually took down the hide. That was amazing! All right, I better get to that prison they call school. Wednesday, are you okay? Yes, Enid, I'm fine. And, uh, is that blood on your wax? What was that? Um, well, it's blood of the hide. Oh my gosh, according to this, they've marked us as tiny! Oh! Don't worry, we're just a little late for school. The principal won't care, right? She cares, Molly. She always cares. Wednesday Adams, Wednesday Adams, and her roommate Enid, please report to my office immediately. Oh, great. Now I'm going to get in trouble. Well, at least now we have that in common. Ugh! Wednesday, you're infuriating! <laughs> you said you wanted something in common with me, and now you have it. Well, well, well. Look who decided to show up to school. Why are you late? Uh, Bally, I wouldn't tell her the truth. Well, I was busy killing the hide, see? With my axe here. <gasps> what are you talking about? That is very dangerous. You both shall have detention for a month. What? I can't have detention for a month. I have to go to werewolf camp every night. My mom said so. Well, you'll have to be suspended from werewolf camp for the month. Ugh! Wednesday! You're so frustrating! So, you still want to be my roommate? I can't believe this. And guess what? We didn't even do this morning routine right. What? What are you talking about? Thing? Snap your fingers! If we're going to do a morning routine, then we have to do it in our room at Nevermore. Ah, look at my beautiful side of the room. And then look at Enid's. Ugh, she's so annoying. Mm -hmm.